I'm Morgan Davies, representing elders of uh, Bensdale, the livestock manager, and uh, one of the two, myself and David Hill, we're in charge of the mountain calf sales at Omeo, Benambra and Ense. The sales over a rule started at ben, uh, Benambra. Uh, the best, best calves made $1,130. Dollars made uh, by Graham Pendergast and his family. Uh, they were fantastic penny calves, and the yarding of cattle was probably 30 or 40 kilos heavier as a rule over the yarding of calves. Calves averaged between $2.50 and $2.60 or $70 in some very extreme sales on your lighter cattle. Now, the next day started at NSA at 11 o'clock. Uh, again, a fantastic yarding of cattle. I think there was 1,100, no, 1,200 neat. Uh, fantastic run of Hereford with your traditional Newcomen cattle and also your other vendors, uh, skews, turnip partnerships and so on and so forth. Fantastic um, yarning of cattle, ladies. And, and it, it was really a, a really solid sale all the way through. It averaged $60 more than Omeo, Herefords and Benambra, which I'll go further on to the Omeo, Herefords. But as a rule, the cattle were uh, lighter, EU, all and everything was weaned, which was a massive part of the, uh, the, selling, uh, the selling popularity for those cattle. Uh, the best cattle there made 1165, which topped by evident Dot Newcomen of Ensay. They have a Hereford uh, Shorthorn Cross cattle. Having said that, there were some fantastic runs of uh, Hereford steers owned by Reese Newcomen, 100% Hereford blood, and they were really good steers, uh, predominantly Newcomen blood. But throughout those sales, there was also Mawara blood, Nani on blood cattle as well sold at the um, sold at the Ensay calf sale. Thirdly, starting at two o'clock was the Omeo Hereford calf sale. The calves here were heavier by about 30 or 40 kilos than there was at Ensay. Uh, having said that, the best calves made $1,160 by the PC Faithful family. Uh, they also won the supreme pen of calves in the mountains. Uh, they're beautiful soft coated calves with plenty of weight, plenty of shape. F the first pen probably weighed 440 kilos, the second pen probably 410 or 20 and they made $1,160. Uh, throughout the sale there was plenty of feeder competition over all the three sales by t uh, Thomas Foods Australia and the EU cattle especially made 10 or 20 cents more. The sale today, uh, yeah, I have to say it was a very good sale today. The uh, this is perhaps the best lineup of cattle I've seen at NSA. Um, great depth in the cattle. Cattle after a wonderful season here, probably the best season in living memory. And as a result, the cattle look look great and they're well grown. Um, it's especially pleasing after last year's sale, which was washed out uh, with a thunderstorm on the eve of the sale. And as a result, prices were fairly fairly uh, disastrous actually. Uh, but this year prices are good. In fact, uh, I would suggest perhaps up well, at least $100, perhaps $200 in some cases. Yeah, well today I consider it as one of the best calf sales, or well, definitely is the best calf sale I've ever seen here at Penambra. Um, yeah, I'm comparing to last year's prices, um, the same calves that the stand I'm standing here with now, I got $734, $730 for them. Um, today I got $1,020. Um, my seconds last year I got $590. Today I got $910. Um, the calves have had a really good season, there's no doubt about that. But uh, weight wise, uh, I wouldn't say that they're possibly 10, 20 kilos at the most, but probably only 10 kilos heavier. Heifers, um, I got 445 last year, today I got uh, 760. So overall, probably an average of $300 up on everything on last year, to give or take. Um, but yes, and the quality of cattle over the whole yarding this year is a, a real credit to, to all the vendors and um, and the buyers. Well, I hope at the other end, those bullock fatness that have bought up well, um, bought top quality cattle. I hope they get a really good um, uh, return at the other end. The Herefords have always got a great temperament. They're always easy to handle, easy to manage. Um, we like that first cross cows with the, the short on cross. They make wonderful mothers and uh, it's just been, I don't know that I'd ever go with any other breed but apart from Herefords. Hello, hello, hello ladies and gentlemen. This is the last leg of the mountain calf sales. I'd like to thank you all, the buyers, the clients and the staff for the support that we get and receive, ladies and gentlemen. It is